Hello and welcome to Andy Little Sci-Fi Horror Show. My name's Andy. This is my little 10-minute window to the rest of the world, and I am here in Andy Land. I am joined by Ken, coming down the stairs. Today we're going to attempt something. Another bucket list thing I've always wanted to do. It actually comes from a Christmas present from Ken himself. He bought me a kit for a, a spooky Tesla radio. Yes, a Tesla spirit radio. Not that Benjamin Franklin stuff. No, I'm talking about Tesla. We'll start with an open area to work. We're going to take this step by step because even with the two kits that were ordered, we don't know if we have all the right parts yet. So this could be a multi-day project. The schematics seem straightforward enough, but first things first, like I said, we got to get a place to work. Yeah. All right, here we go. We're going to cut the resin tops at this size out of this clear plastic. Is this actual plexiglass? Yes. Cool. This should be tedious and uh, something. We have tight working quarters today. And Ken's going to be doing the tricky cutting stuff first. And then I'll join him in on the construction of it later. But I got my appropriate gear on. I love this shirt. All right, stuff has hit the table. It begins. Nasty ground down. Yeah. Not too much though, just a little bit. Hey, here we go with round two. It's got a weird burning smell. It's like glue? It's like the burning wood in the engine and all that. It's got a weird funky smell. There it is, a pristine round cut of pixie glass. Doing a little research. These things don't require a battery source. No. That's the wild thing. Well, yeah, most of our projects, that's our biggest obstacle. I realized it wasn't very scary, but now this is for effect. Those prongs won't be an issue. That, that won't be a problem right there. I had to count us into holes to get the threads to start. This is the satisfying part. This prong's gonna go flush against the plastic. Yeah, you probably can bend it down. Well, it's hand tight. The uh, other antenna is which one? I'm opposite of that. Here. Yeah. Okay, gotcha. Turn it on. Okay, we're gonna make the hole bigger. All right, one more time. Perfect. There it is. This should turn. Nice. It does. Okay. Now, make this snug. There we go. Oops, a little too snug. The magnet coil. <laughs> See, like this is our battery source. I guess you could say. Feel the power. Here we go. Okay, 20 gauge. I can see how you can get better at this very quickly. This is not conventional, but I don't think Tesla would disapprove. Ken has that look on his eyes like, I just came up with the smartest idea way too late. 
I knew it! Damn, was I recording you saying that? I recorded you saying that. Alien tape. Oh my god, I'm gonna cut. <laughs> well, yes, it looks like a 70s sci fi antenna for a robot. This, I think, will work. And I was right, Ken had come up with a better idea. Are you gonna cut the red wire? And <laughs> solder. <laughs> cool. That's good. That's ground. Right. And white. All right, beer box, Tesla coil radio, booby continued. Booby continued. Okay, welcome to day two of Tesla Spooky Ghost Radio. Ken, feeling better? He's done some research. This print is done, I guess it came out good. So that puts all things in good spirit. So, I'm going to turn around this way. This is where we're at. Oh, he's got notes. Damn, I love when he has notes. This really isn't your Radio Shack brings in the cardboard box kind of thing. You look at the thing with the wire in the middle, remember those things? I love those things. And you make those connections. If you know what I'm talking about, you know what I'm talking about. There's actually a checklist. And ironically, it's got dun 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 13 things on it. That's perfect. We got our ghost company back in the corner. We took down the holiday decorations upstairs. Now our ghost is back in the corner. sure there's a lot of people out there saying, God, that's sloppy. But there's a whole lot more people saying out there, oh my God, I'm glad I don't have to do that. It's a work of art. The guy here, monstrosity. Yeah, it will work though. The mad scientist. <laughs> Looks cool. Now those things. I'm gonna tape mine like that. A bit of duct tape. A little bit of a stray from the design, but I think this is kind of cool. Let's in there. Now let's just test that because I don't know if I fully trust my connection. I wouldn't want to have you have done all that crap and then it, like be something on the stupid antenna's end. Yep, good. This is awesome. Excellent. Want to try that one? Yep. Speaking to us already. Okay. The modern day technology. It's with the old school stuff. The, it is. Weird. Perry. Here it is, the Tesla Spirit Radio, our variation of it. Now, we need some kind of external speaker source, preferably something with some power. We're gonna try a couple of things. We'll try the amplifier, we'll try the amplifier, we'll try a laptop, and see if we can get any resonation from it. For all I know, we could be getting it right now, but we can't hear it. Here it is, Tesla Spooky Ghost Radio. This is our own variation that it with the gears and stuff. We didn't get a whole lot out of it yet, but we do have some backup here. We're going to try another time with a proper connection because this is a quarter inch jack and it's an eighth inch jack. So, congratulations, Ken, and thank you, and Merry Christmas. This is the boss. That's all the time we have for episode of Angel's Life at Horse Show. My name's Andy. I'm Ken. And this is it Project Achieved. <laughs>